Hey guys, Retarded Bot here. Here we have from right to left is the Rat 3, the Rat 7, and the Rat 9 with its uh, wireless base station. Okay, starting with the Rat 9, the wireless base station here holds a battery, and this little circle at the top holds its weights with a little cartridge as well. Um, the Rat 9 and the Rat 7 are pretty much identical um, in both size and customization, except one's wired and one's not. They both look the same on the base. And the Rat 3 is almost a completely different story. It does have the same kind of base style to it, except if we turn it around. You can see this little kind of red wire going in from the back and up to the the, the clicker. It doesn't have any customization to it. Everything is bog standard. You can't move anything or resize anything. Uh, you'll notice already that the wheel mouse is an all black compared to a, um, an aluminium or an, an alloy there with the Rat 7 and Rat 9. On the base, it is completely plastic. There's no aluminium to it. It is very light. And the RAT3 only actually has a DPI rating of 3200 compared to the RAT7 and the RAT9 which has a rating of 5600 each. Yeah, so there's your three mice. There is a RAT5, but unfortunately I wasn't able to review that because I don't think New Zealand actually gets, gets the RAT5. But I don't think I need to see a rat fiber because these pretty much cover the basis for what a customized mice can actually do. I mean, I don't think there's really much more, much less you'd want to, to change about them. Alright, see you guys later.